What's up, everybody? It's Mike for coming back again. Uh, again, apologize for the shaky cam in between cameras at the moment using my phone. I'm going to show you the Sony Veo or Remote Play for the PS3 on PC for a non Sony Veo machine on my MacBook Air right now in virtual VMware style. Right now, we're just installing the actual application itself, Remote Play with PlayStation 3. I'm running 64-bit Windows, so the patching I'll do will be in a little bit different directory than 32-bit would be. So the main order we're going to do is we want to install the program for Remote Play with PlayStation 3. After we do that, we're going to run a batch file to register some DLLs. After that, we're going to copy the DLLs to a directory and then be able to run activation. So, that should be... Finish there. Now, I made a batch file because I'm lazy. That wasn't supposed to work like that. <clears throat> okay, let's see here. I'm going to do this old school. Okay, now we'll pull up command prompt here. Of course, it'd be a lot easier with two hands. Okay, and the command's gotta run. The right folder. Oh, sorry about the slowness here. It's been a while since I've done this. There you go, you should get the OK, and then we're going to do the same thing. To the VRP mapping DLL. Oops, there we go. There we go. Now, after we do that, we can paste those files. Overwrite them. And... There it is. Okay, I think the problem, if you get any errors about dxd30.el not found, you need your DirectX runtime, so hit our Microsoft.com and get it on download. Okay, so let's see here. Now we're going to try to initially pair with our PS3. What is Remote Play? Got our guide here. Next. MacBook Air Win 7, sure. Okay, now we got to go over here. A new uh, screen saver. From the PSN store. Pretty classy, actually, I like it. Yep. 
Okay, so okay, so the numbers in here. So, register right away again. MacBook Air. Now we're gonna have to go here after you're done registering it. It'll tell you complete. We'll go back to network remote play. Play in remote play mode. There we go. And connect. This is Windows 64 running in VMware. Notice. And there we go. And there's our PS3. Okay, it's so in a browser. Someone was wondering about if I can use it actually to type with, which I don't think you can. So Z is X. Yeah, you can't. So no, you cannot. Oops, well, let's make sure. Nope, you have to use the control pad controls over there. So there you go. The how to install it and in, in action again. Alright, peace.